In a wave of protests across U.S. universities, hundreds of students have been arrested amid calls for a Gaza ceasefire and divestment from companies tied to Israel's ongoing conflict with Palestine. Police presence intensified as demonstrations escalated, with reports of chemical irritants and tasers being used to disperse protesters. In Boston, around 100 individuals were detained at Northeastern University, prompting the school to declare the area secured after clashes with authorities. Northeastern University claimed Claimed external organizers infiltrated the protests, citing chance of kill the Jews to justify their crackdown. However, conflicting reports suggest Israeli flag holders used the slur to incite tension. Similar incidents unfolded in Bloomington, where 23 were arrested, and at Arizona State University, where 69 were detained for trespassing. At Washington University in St. Louis, 80 arrests were made, including U.S. presidential candidate Jill Stein and her campaign manager. Despite university efforts to contain protests, demonstrations persist nationwide, prompting clashes with law enforcement and disciplinary actions against students and faculty. Pro-Palestine activism has sparked a debate over free speech and campus policies, resulting in arrests, suspensions and cancellations of graduation ceremonies at various institutions.